all things gluten free, Miss Jennifer. You know it. Be free, gluten free, free free. All right. So nice to have you in. Thank you so much. Okay, shall we get down to the nitty gritty and talk about this golden ticket? Oh, wow. what, what is Did this you want all to see about? It again? I Just, do. You know, it's shiny and flashy. Well, this is kind of a big deal. It is a really big deal. So um, back in June, uh, we were part of what Walmart calls open call, mm. and um, they sent out invitations um, to select people who, you know, kind of fit certain criteria yeah. that they're looking for, and it's all about keeping and creating more jobs in the United States. Walmart has made a $35 billion commitment to that effort, and so we were one of the, the recipients. And so what the so golden cool. <laughs> Awesome. What the golden ticket means is it's a it's just a it's a pro, it's a symbol of a promise to do business. Okay. So we have um, an agreement to go into 310 Sam's Club stores wow. in February. So it's a big deal for us. It's the biggest piece of business that that we've had, That's a and thing. it's no, um, it's, not. <laughs> it's you know it will. Um, we were notified in, yeah. in June of that because. It takes many months for a small business to prepare for that well, type of an order and that of type small of business. business yes. and gluten free. Let, let's show some stuff. Yeah. Off and talk about what you do because you're exactly. going to be mixing some stuff up for us. I too. am. I am. So um, I wanted to show some of the ways that you can eat our product, okay. which is Warrior Mix. So okay. certainly you can eat it right out of the bag, but also you can bake with it. So you can make these really Ooh, delicious um, pumpkin chocolate. Warrior bites. So, do you want me? You want me to mix yes, that now? Right. Yeah. Okay. Let's show some okay. Awesome. All right. I love action. So While you're doing that, we where, where does that, that warrior theme come from? You, the, you know, Ooh. when when we when we were um, looking for a name for our company, mm -hmm. we wanted something that was empowering, that really made um, people feel like what they were That's eating good. was going to not only nourish their body but their soul. And oh, so wow. we landed on uh, Warrior Mix. Yeah. This so is, this is nourishing my body and my soul. Oh, this good. Sure Hopefully, it's going to give you some some serious warrior powers today too, I to get through like whatever. The gluten-free world has kind of, I don't want to say taken over. It's much different than what it, it used is. to be. There's so many options. For sure. But the misconception is, oh, gluten-free. It's not. Is it going to taste good? Is it going to taste good? Yeah. It, this yeah. is delicious. Well, I'm so glad you mm -hmm. like it. Mm -hmm. So when we were creating recipes early on. Um, one of the things that was really important to me was that the food not only tasted delicious, but it was made with good quality ingredients, but, but that everyone could eat it around our table. So we got okay. into gluten-free back in um, 2008 when my husband and I were looking for support for our son with autism. Mm -hmm. So, and we landed on gluten-free. Oh, so this is a personal mission. It's for a you personal too. mission, and what we found was there weren't a whole lot of really delicious, tasty options out there yeah. in the marketplace. Mm -hmm. So we created our own. So it was wow. important that. Everyone in our family, we're a family of six. Everyone could sit down and eat the same food together. Wow. So, and Is there some, uh, some relief to that mm -hmm. when, when families see that they can be gluten-free and it tastes good? So, oh, huge. Yeah, because yeah. you, you nailed it. You know, there's a big mis mis misconception about gluten-free foods mm -hmm. because back in the early days, Gluten-free didn't taste like it does today. Right, right. You know, it really, it, it's come a long way. And I say, it's come a long yeah. way, baby, you know? <laughs> and, I mean, it really has. And so, you know, in part, there's a demand. And when there's a demand in the marketplace, um, you know, people rise to the occasion. And then they create things that weren't available before. That's awesome. So, yeah. That's so good. So, so you saw me mix all of these really simple ingredients. The other thing I love about this, it's a one bowl recipe. Yes. I'm all about the simplicity, right? Yeah. So, dishes. <laughs> limited dishes. It's got to taste good. So you and did it's peanut really, butter. So I did peanut butter with a little oh, bit of yes. honey. Wow. Okay, little honey. Um, almond flour and um, a little bit of protein powder. Okay. So, okay. like, you, it gives you a little protein kick as well, too. Okay. So, yeah. Um, and then, so we're just going to mix that all together and then. Um, warrior mix crumbles are mixed in there as well too. Okay. So our warrior mix comes in chunks. It's made in a cluster style, you, so you can tear open oh, the yeah. package I see this here. and right. let's open it. Oh, you want to? Yeah, yeah Randall. Um, so, so you can just tear it open and dig in and grab now, a chunk. And there are different ones because this are. is Augie's original. Yes. There's salted mm -hmm. caramel, salted caramel, berry bomb, Hagen's berry bomb, Clay's chocolate, oh, maize you. apple pie. Oh, look at so, that. Yeah, so you see it comes in chunks like that. But a lot of times <laughs> at the bottom of the bag, you'll have some crumbles, right? So you can use those crumbles and kind of like repurpose the crumbles, right, into a recipe. So you oh, add yeah, those crumbles idea. into yeah. your um, peanut butter mix. And then we're just going to take... A little scooper. Mm -hmm. I love portion controlled scoopers. It just makes the job so easy. And, and you're just, right yep, in there. and you're Boom. just going to scoop them in there. And then um, 
I, of course, have clean hands, right? So, <laughs> so we're just going to press it in there on the bottom. So you fill the whole tray, okay. put the peanut butter in there, and then and we're the just the chocolate. Yes. And then it's a no-bake recipe. So oh, you're so going you to put it. Sit? Yep, you're going to pop yes. this. Well, if you want to speed things up, because I always like to get you know, chocolate and peanut butter in my mouth yeah. as fast as possible, <laughs> right? So we're just going to pop that in the freezer until it gets all set up. Good stuff. Take about an yeah. hour or so, oh, and I then you can just take a fork and, and pop them out. There you go. And eat them more. one by yeah. one or and then handful by handful. A handful Love by it. handful. And we're yeah. not done because coming up we're going to talk about these too. Mm -hmm. Good stuff. Jennifer, thank yeah. you so much. Absolutely. We appreciate thank you. These are the ones that Randy ate uh, like 100 miles an no, hour. No. Okay, uh -huh. that makes sense. The warrior <laughs> he bite. Said, he said he's only had one. I don't know, Rand. Oh, I no, think I you got one in your pocket.